What's the plan? We build a shoe line around just him. I believe in your son. I believe he's the future. And his story is going to make us want to fight. But the shoe is just a shoe. That's what my son steps into. Got a name for it? Air Jordan. I don't know. Seriously? No, maybe it'll grow on me. Oh my god! <laughs> that shoe you saw, this guy made it! I'm not kidding you. Uh, I'm so excited. I gotta control myself. Take a breath. Uh, those Air Jordans that you saw in that clip for Air uh, were made by this guy right here in San Diego. Ladies and gentlemen, my new best friend. Ray Marquez, owner and founder of San Diego SD Custom Footwear. Ray, good morning. Good morning, Rome. This is the culmination of 15 years of Sneaker Friday having you here. Very happy to see you, finally you. meeting you. Um, the obvious question now, we'll get to these in a minute. Mm -hmm. How did this happen? How did Ben Affleck and the guys call you and say, we need you to make the sneakers and the props for this film? Well, they, uh, they needed uh, some shoes made. They Googled, you know, custom custom sneakers, custom Jordans, and they found me. They called me up, and he drove that same day. He drove down from L.A., so I knew he was serious. Ben Affleck did? No, no, no. Or the, uh, the prop master. The prop guy from the, the prop movie. The guy from the movie. And then he was, he, came he up, saw the shop, and he's like, oh, my God. He saw the shop, and right away, he's like, I need some samples made. He loved the <laughs> samples, and he ordered, like, 13 pairs more. <laughs> <laughs> so this, obviously, the shoe, that the, the movie is based around... This shoe, the promotion for the Air Jordans and how they decided to get Michael Jordan to be the face right. of this shoe, and he had never played in the NBA, right? So well, they took a gamble, it's all about a gamble. It's all about the risk, and this, yeah. this was actually not in the movie, this is one of the prototypes right. that didn't make it to the movie, so I made about eight different models that were yeah. kind of like the Air Force evolving into the Jordan 1. So oh Nice. So yeah, the, I, love the, I love the movie, the message about the movie, um, how Nike gambled it all on this one yeah. rookie. And sometimes you have to do that. They were fledgling, they were struggling. They're like, this is the yeah. thing, and now look at them. Uh, when you're making these products, I mean, were you stressed out? Or like, ah, eh, you're fine, whatever. If it works, it works. No, if it I doesn't, mean, I keep doing my thing. When the guy, uh, when the prop master, JP, um, came out, yeah, yeah, yeah. he saw my shoes, he, he liked them, and I was like, well, he liked these, and I can make them even better than that, so I'll be fine. <laughs> so here's what makes you, uh, this guy, extra cool. So yesterday, we're like talking, okay, let's make it happen, let's do this for Sneaker Friday, the movie just came out, they're like, well, we'll see, let me see if Ray's available, because he's finishing up a pair of shoes for Snoop Dogg. <laughs> I'm like, really? <laughs> Your celebrity list is like, I don't have time for all of them, but Snoop Dogg, Ryan Reynolds, even uh, Jack in the Box, even. How do you get in touch with all these big celebs to, to make shoes for him. Well, my manager, Paul's been helping out. Oh, Paul's and, uh, like dude right there? Yeah. We're, uh, we're kind of like the dude from over here. You know the yeah. dude from the yeah. thing? Of course, I love the dude. <laughs> so he calls and he kind of hooks all this stuff up? Yeah, I wow. mean, we're you know hitting up local companies, you know, San Diego companies, and of course, uh, Jack in the Box, um, yeah. you know, we, we started our relationship and, and we're making the shoes for their commercials. One yeah. of them including Snoop Dogg, Ryan Reynolds, and uh, some more later this year. You know, Fox 5, um, you know. <laughs> Just yeah, saying. it's just, <clears throat> just saying. Uh, give me a give me a rundown of, of what you brought because these are obviously you know Megan Healy walked by and said, "Is this pineapple?" Well, so let's um, get to the shoes because what is this here? That this is, is actually a fish from the Amazon's called Piruku, but for me it looked like a pineapple. So this was two years ago. My my uh, 420 released the Pineapple Express. <laughs> looks like pineapple. Why is everybody laughing? <laughs> I call these the. Uh, Exotic AF, because oh everything's goodness. exotic, even a little alligator tail. I mean, look at that. Stingray. And these are, stingray. I mean, it's quality leather, it's quality. Uh, yeah, everything this is, is like a, high quality stuff. This here, alligator right? itself is Ooh. probably $700. Oh my God. And um, are these fours? I mean, yeah, those are the Oh uh, my God. <laughs> I didn't like the color of the midsole, so I wrapped it in suede. Of course you did. <laughs> oh my God, can you imagine if my kid steps on these when, oh my, I'm a, mm, mm, no, they're not gonna do that. Uh, okay, oh, whoa, what is okay, that? Okay, so we take apart the shoes. That's and amazing. This is a mask that my friend Danny from Miami made. He makes masks. We take apart the shoes and we make all sorts of things with, uh, with the leftover parts. We make clothing, we, we add them to hoodies, pants. We were even making a duffel bag out of 40 pairs of shoes. Oh my God. Listen, how did you know that you had this talent? I always ask people who are uber talented and artistic, like uh -huh. at what point did you know, 
this is something I can do. Because not everybody, everybody loves sneakers. Right. A lot of people are really into sneakers. Not everybody, almost no. nobody can do what you do. Well, since I was little, my mom worked at sewing kind of factories and she would bring work home and I learned how to sew since I was, I don't know how old. Yeah. And it just all the sewing machines, all this kind of just felt at home for me. And it all came together because you like Lakers, you like this, you like the shoes, and it's just kind of all the yeah, world I mean, came I, together. I don't want to upset anybody, but I didn't grow up a sneakerhead. Ain't nobody <laughs> upset over that, man. It's okay. You kind of grow into the role, and now I grew up with the, you know, the Payless and, you know. So did I. I had, I was telling you, you know, I had what was called, I had the fake Reeboks. Yeah. Man. I had the one that said tracks that you got at like uh, 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 Zodi's. Huh? That's old school. Reference for you guys. Nobody remembers Zodis exactly. And then in middle school, and kids said, those are fake Reeboks. That's a moment in my <laughs> life. <laughs> Don't give in to peer pressure, but I did. And I'm yeah. like, okay, whatever. Uh, show me these. These are so okay, neat because so they look like a comic book. Yeah, so these, um, my daughter painted shout out my kids, Jordan, Andrea, Fernando, Alex. Wait, what's the one kid's name? Jordan, my son. How old is Jordan? He's 25. You have a 25 year old kid? Yes. <laughs> what the We can heck? talk about that next segment. How old are you? Wait, <laughs> wait a minute. I'm trying to do the math here. Okay, so, yeah, so Jordan's math. 25, go ahead. Yeah, so uh, we have a one day class where we can paint shoes, just do stuff like this. It's a. Uh, I just happen, okay, go ahead and keep talking yeah, about it. I have just like happened a date to night where we have yeah. these clean Air Force Ones. This is what I call, as an artist, is oh, a blank slate. That's exactly what it is, a blank canvas. Not a, co not a coincidence. Come out with your kids, with your wife, and yeah. paint your shoes one afternoon. And, I will uh, take these off right now and give them. Uh, okay, so these, and these, this is the other pair of these. So this is just kind of how we, oh, I see. How wow. we mold them. They have a plastic wow. glass inside. Yeah, show the camera there. Yeah, yeah. We wrap the leather around. And, this and is the sole's not it. on there. And then we attach the sole. Oh my God. And NASA, NASA shoes, they're like moon rock. Oh my God, it's like a moon. Okay, <sighs> you've never seen these. I've, as far as I know, let's give them a minute here. Hold on. <laughs> Catch his breath. I can't, I can't with this. Well, go ahead. As far I'm as I know, I'm the only person ever to make shoes out of bullfrog leather. All right. <laughs> this is what? bullfrog leather. Bullfrog leather. So I saw it at our. Look at the detail. Look I at saw that. it at our factory at a. Uh, I thought, you know what, this could, I can make this look like a uh, moon surface if I yeah, paint it gray, I paint it one angle white, another angle black, and we have moon shoes. Bro, what in the world? <laughs> yeah, we, need to, we, need, we need to hang out, but I'm not nearly cool enough. Uh, uh, you got me, this I'm... class, tell me, it, can anybody do this class? Is the class painting or is the class like... So we have two different classes. Or... Okay, so you can take the thing apart and, and do yep. it? Okay, go ahead. So our painting class is just, you know, three or four hours. Uh, our recon class is four days, and in those four days, you can make your shoe. The first day, we choose your materials. We cut and trace and cut. I, I, every student gets all their pattern pieces, so it's oh, pretty wow. easy. You just trace trace your leather, cut it. The second day, we start sewing. By day four, you walk out with shoes you made. Listen, I stress out on the Nike app trying to do the colors <laughs> on my, and I, I could never even imagine it. You can help and guide well, them. Well, yeah, I help by hiding all the leather. I just give them fewer <laughs> options. <laughs> <laughs> that actually helps. Uh, so that's cool. There's a whole schedule of classes. Uh, yep. You can probably reach out, go to the website, and do all that. I know that you're big. I saw your, on your Instagram, it's like customs versus reps. These mm -hmm. ain't reps. Yeah. Don't trip. And reps are like, you know, like replica. Those yeah, cheap replicas are. Things. Yeah. We don't like this. Although nowadays, I can barely even tell the difference. They're getting so um, good. Listen, Ray, uh, congratulations. Thank continued you. Continued success. I love that. You know, your son was born the year Michael Jordan, uh, uh, the last dance year. Yeah, 98. 98. Or, yeah, the last dance was 98. 98. Look at this guy. Uh, continued success. Thank you, Congrats. Uh, Thank the you. movie's great. It's out in theaters now. Air. Oh, my God. Best sneaker Friday ever. We'll be right back.